what happens if one of your tenants does stop paying rent? Well, have to be, uh, we, we have to be ready for that to, to happen. And, you know, if God forbid the tenant stops paying rent, we, um, we, we would hope that it doesn't end in an eviction uh, because those are expensive for the owner. But, but our, our, uh, our role is to, number one, send them out a, a, a notice right away if we haven't received their rent. If, if they've missed, we make, we make rents due on the first and, and late on the second as a general, as a general rule in, in our leases. Sometimes we, we will make some modifications to that depending upon the tenant's uh, specific situation, but that's, um, that's, that's, generally the, that's generally the case. If, uh, if they're not being respond, well, well, we was with the next step is to, is if, if we we're not getting a response from them and they haven't paid and we will post a five day notice, um, on their door and send that notice by certified mail, which, um, is, is the legal steps that one needs to take when, when, uh, st starting an eviction on a tenant. If uh, that five days runs its course and we still haven't received payment, we turn that file over to the attorney and uh, and file for eviction. The attorney files for eviction, and uh, okay. that's, that's what that.